You've used the word barbaric when it comes to the American healthcare system. Yes. Strong word. Why use that word? Well, that's the best way to describe it because your access to healthcare in the United States is predicated on your ability to pay. And healthcare is a right that all people should have access to. That sounds terrible, but uh, it, it, healthcare is not something that you want a gate for people to have to go through. It's only since the 1990s uh, that legislation was introduced that hospitals have to treat you if you have a life-threatening illness. Uh, so we were late to the game in that. Um, at this point, our emergency rooms, our a &Es, are overcrowded, but that's because people can't afford to go to the doctor. So what do they do? They put off going to the doctor until they absolutely right. have to go life-threatening situation, they show up at the emergency room where they have to take them in. Now, at the moment they decide that it's not a life-threatening condition, they will boot them out to uh, a hospital that either takes in people without insurance or they'll recommend that they go to some other convalescence facility or uh, to their own doctor. If you arrive at the emergency room in an ambulance and it's not a life-threatening condition, before they take you out of the amb ambulance, uh, they will check to make sure you have your insurance cards on you so that they can get that information, so that they can make sure that their bills will be paid.